One out of 10. Those are your chances of going into septic shock if you're a patient in a hospital intensive care unit. This happens mostly because patients can be very sick with complex illnesses. Doctors at Mayo Clinic want to improve those odds. They've developed smart alarm technology that constantly monitors a patient's status and alerts them before bad events happen. With all these alarms, it's no wonder many people say they can't get any rest in the hospital. They um, go off all the time. They contribute to increasing the noise level, um, sleep deprivation, post-traumatic stress disorder to providers and patients as well. Dr. Ognan Gajic also says most of the alarms you hear in the intensive care unit are not signaling real problems. They usually happen because someone moved or a device like a pulse oximeter slipped off someone's finger. Yes, monitors help, but in addition to being loud, they only monitor certain things. There's no way to constantly and thoroughly check a patient's status. That's why Dr. Gajic teamed up with Dr. Vitaly Herazovich, who developed a smart alarm called a sniffer. It can sniff out serious, life-threatening complications unobtrusively before bad events happen. This technology can bring another layer of uh, patient safety. You see, patients in the ICU are often very sick with complicated illnesses. The risk of someone developing septic shock from an infection such as pneumonia is quite high, one out of 10. But the new alarm system is run by a computer that brings all the patient's information, such as lab values, ventilator settings, blood pressure, heart rate, and oxygenation into one place. Then it monitors that information around the clock and sniffs out dangers. If there is a potential danger for patient safety, the computer uh, alarm, the sniffer, pages the provider with a message. So it's in a timely notification that something potentially dangerous is about to, to happen and uh, before it actually happens. Sniffers are one more way doctors are trying to improve patient safety in the hospital. For Medical Edge, I'm Vivian Williams.